Good morning, good morning. Seniors, I need you to listen carefully, please. Number one thing I want to say, announcements will be delivered by Jostens on April the 13th, which is next week. I did get the balance sheet and there are only like about four people here in the school that still owe a balance, which is great. Um, if you have a question as to whether you've ordered or not, I will try to put some list up just saying whether you ordered and you, you can check on that, okay? The second thing, valedictorians, your rough draft of your speech was due to me today. So if you can, either email me or whatever. Let me see a speech today from you. Um, caps and gowns will be delivered on April the 27th. Guys, if you have not paid for them at this time, you may get a telephone number from me and do it by credit card with Jostens. If you do not do that, you must have cash or money order for me on the 27th and it will go to Jostens. You'll get your cap and gown at that time. They are taking no more personal checks. So as far as Jostens is concerned, no personal checks. We're getting the debt list together, Miss Debbie James in English and myself, and that debt list will be coming out. Realize please that the debt list that we put out is not the end of it because as this year goes on, it adds too, so keep your eyes on the debt list and realize too that if you don't pay the debt, you don't walk at graduation. Thanks. Hey Siegel, so as some of y'all already know, next week we'll be doing several events to support Baylor Bramble and we will be selling uh, t-shirts, the short sleeve ones, today at lunch and all next week during lunch. You can also go to Miss Brown and order one from her. And then next Friday, there's a dodgeball tournament during the activity period. Uh, we already have most of our teams together, but we would love for all of y'all to buy a ticket for $5 and come and support, and all those proceeds go to the family. And then that next Saturday on the 16th, Blackman High School is hosting the Bramble Bash, which is a five-on-five -five basketball tournament and a carnival outdoor kind of day. So just bring out your family, friends, and all proceeds to that also go to the family. Thank you. Hey, National Honor Society, just a reminder that your 20 points are due by April 14th, as well as your $21 for the sash. And uh, you should have gotten a slip from your English teacher, from Ms. Hall, about your points. If you need more points, go to Ms. Hall today for another point opportunity. Thanks. All right, good morning, Siegel. That's great things going on here uh, in the springtime. We got a couple uh, headlines in the paper today I want to talk about. On the front page is a picture of Mr. Benefield and Mr. Pearson, two players on the baseball team. Uh, congratulations to them. Whoop. Staying hot, they've won eight straight ball games. Uh, congratulations to the whole team, Coach Revis, Coach Fields, Coach Reeder, uh, Coach Tobit, all those guys that are uh, doing great things for those players. Uh, I hope they are winning in the classroom as well is what I expect. So anyways, congratulations to them. They finished off another game tonight here uh, against Blackman. Uh, also in the paper is our softball team, not to be outdone. But it says Siegel racks, racks up another shutout. Uh, Veronica Westfall again strikes out 12 batters. Sadie Loftus, I think, hit a home run. Uh, Coach Lyons is doing a great job with the girls' team or softball team. They're 23 and 4. Uh, you know, we talk about rankings and all that, but we're just uh, looking to be the last team standing at the end of the day. And that's, uh, we're not really looking at all those rankings and top 10s and stuff like that. We're just looking for W's, just like in the classroom. Looking for W's and wins. Things like that. But anyways, uh, congratulations again, teachers. You guys probably have a, a much bigger effect on wins and losses than you think. Keep on pushing these uh, young men and women in the classroom so then when it comes time uh, during the game, they can pull through. So anyways, uh, let's have a great day, day here at Siegel. Miss James, I think, is coming on. Yeah. Hey, I am talking this morning to your Siegel Senior Girls. Siegel Senior Girls. That's right. That's what I'm talking about. All right, you are having senior, senior girls shirt. <laughs> Presley's being funny. Will be on sale starting Friday, April 8th through Wednesday, April 13th during all three lunches. They're comfort color shirts. They're $15. Come and get this last memento of your senior year, girls. See you later. Juniors, want to know how to get most out of a college fair or a campus tour? Come get the answers to these and any other questions you may have 
at College Planning Night, Thursday, April 14th at 6 o'clock in the auditorium. Not only will there be a presentation to answer your questions, but there will also be a college fair, light refreshments, and raffles to win a college gear and college survival items, such as a mini fridge for your dorm room. Auditions for the 2016 Seagulls Got Talent will take place April 18th in the choir room right after school. Please sign up for auditions on the choir room door. The show will be April 27th at 7 in the theater. Students who have been accepted to Governor's School for summer 2016 need to see Miss Harold at once. Seniors who have four years or 12 years of perfect attendance need to see Miss Harold this week. Beach Bash Party after prom on April 23rd from 11 to 3. All are invited. It's not just for prom attendees and their dates. It's for any Seagull senior who wants to come out and have a good time. Food, DJ, games, prizes, wrecking ball, maze, kapow! Woo $15 gets you all the stuff mentioned plus a cool t-shirt. Live it up one last time, 2016. Now on to you, Mason. Thanks, Connor. Students participating in the Job Shadow program April 19th need to see Ms. Harrell for updated information. Seniors, a reminder about your money off your prom ticket as part of last year's ACT incentive package. 30 plus students, you will get 50% off your prom ticket. ACT scores of 29 and through 25, students will get $10 off. Those who scored a 21 through a 24 will get $5 off. Ms. Serrano has already given Ms. Gannon a list of all your names. When you go to buy your prom ticket, then show them your ID so they can check you off the list. DECA is now taking pre-orders for the short sleeve Baylor shirts during all three lunches through until next Thursday. Shirts are $10 each and all profits will help cover medical costs for Baylor Bramble. Teachers, if you would like to order one, then please email Ms. Brown with your information. Thank you for your continued support for the Bramble family. All Beta Club members who signed up for the water drive, there will be a meeting on Friday, April 8th during star time. That's today. Please report to the English Computer Lab at that time. Juniors, this week and next week are it for the free ACT tutoring. These are the last two weeks and, and they are focused on the ACT English section. See Ms. Goble in room 108 for a star time pass. April 19th will be here before you know it. You've got this. Tennessee Promise applicants, remember to complete your community service hours. Anyone attending a TCAP must, it, must have his or hers hours completed by May 1st, 2016. That's all for your announcement, Siegel. Have a kapow! Woo -woo! Friday. <laughs>